In this video, we'll show you how to set up a rule using the Swidget app. Rules are made up of a trigger and one or multiple actions. You can use a sensor insert like air quality or motion to control the device that it is installed in or to control other devices in your Swidget library. For this example, we will create a basic vacancy rule to automatically turn off all of the devices in the living room when it becomes unoccupied. To get started, click on the Automations button at the bottom of the screen, click the plus sign or Create Automation, then choose Rule and enter a name. I will call this one Living Room Vacancy. Next, select Trigger and choose Motion. Select Unoccupied and enter how many minutes you want to pass before the action is triggered. If you want to receive a notification when the rule has been triggered, click the toggle button. To add an action, click the plus sign and choose the first device you want to control. I'm going to turn off my ceiling fan and lamp when the room has been vacant for five minutes. Lastly, you can choose some conditions such as a start and end time within which you want the rule to work, as well as whether you want it to be enabled every day or only on specific days of the week. Click Save Rule when you are finished. Back on the automation screen, you can click on the down arrow to see a preview of your automations. You can also swipe right to disable and re-enable a rule or schedule, or swipe left to delete it. Check out the Swidget YouTube channel to find videos on how to make a schedule, receive notifications, and much more. Thanks for watching.